The Witcher 4 will get a new director. CD Projekt Red has announced that a new Witcher trilogy of games is already on the way. The first installment, dubbed as Witcher 4 by fans of the series, officially has the codename Polaris and is described by CDPR as the beginning of a new saga. Plot details are scarce at this point, but we have a big update about the next game in the series. CD Projekt Red veteran Sebastian Kalemba has announced on Twitter that he will be directing the new Witcher saga. Career news, I'm directing the new Witcher saga, Kalemba tweets. Since joining CD Projekt Red I believe nothing is impossible and raising the bar, telling emotional stories and creating worlds is what we're here for. However, this announcement is clearly a very early one it's obvious from the language that the game is still in the early stages of development, and the developer simply wanted to let people know what it was embarking on, rather than giving any really concrete details. The Witcher 4 Release Date CD Projekt Red announced the next Witcher game was in the works in March 2022, confirming rumors that it would indeed be returning to the dark fantasy world after its extensive dabble with science fiction in the form of Cyberpunk 2077. The announcement does have a couple of key details, though, including the fact that the game will be built on Epic's Unreal Engine 5, rather than CD Projekt's own engine like most of its games historically. This is a major change, but might be a canny reaction to the huge technical issues that plagued Cyberpunk on its release. However, there is no timeline on a release date or even a window, the game is still a long way off, although it finished the concept phase and moved to pre-production in May 2022, according to its developers. Sebastian Kalemba is a 15-year veteran of the gaming industry. According to his LinkedIn profile, Columba joined CD Projekt Red in October 2014 as lead animator. He worked on The Witcher 3 and Cyberpunk 2077 before being promoted as the head of animation. In 2021, he was promoted to creative director. Witcher 4 is still in pre-production at this stage. CD Projekt Red is dividing its development team to work simultaneously on Polaris as well as the Phantom Liberty DLC for Cyberpunk 2077. Witcher 4 will be using Unreal Engine 5 as its game engine. The proprietary Red Engine has been replaced so the development team can focus on the game rather than working on the game engine. We are a long way from the release of Witcher 4. While the studio has confirmed that the research phase of the game has already concluded, it will be a few years before we see the finished project. On an investor call earlier this year, studio president and joint CEO Adam Kaczynski mentioned that Polaris is about three years away from being released. CD Projekt Red will surely take its time with the Witcher franchise. It would not want to repeat the mistakes that were made with Cyberpunk 2077. The game was released with a ton of game-breaking issues and took two solid years before it lived up to its potential. The studio aims to release two more Witcher games after Polaris, creating a new AAA RPG trilogy. This new trilogy is separate from the remake of the original Witcher saga, which has an internal codename of Canis Majoris. The remake is reportedly very early in its development and will be released further down the line. There is no word yet on the release date of The Witcher 3. We expect it to premiere sometime in mid-2023. The Witcher 4 Title Of course, we're calling the game The Witcher 4 at present since it's the fourth main game in the series, but we don't actually know what the game will be called. After the first game each Witcher title had a subtitle, Assassin of Kings and The Wild Hunt, respectively, so we could be in for a numbered entry with a new subtitle. Equally, the announcements are leaving the possibility very much open that we might not be getting a full sequel, but rather a spiritual continuation, with new characters and perhaps locations. It's all up in the air, but for now, we have no idea what the game will be called.